Hey, how are you? Are you full of energy today? Last week I went to see a football match. My brother is a member of a university football team and last week they had another game in the university's football championship. Last season my brother was injured and as a result he missed all games and trainings. In fact, the season started quite unsuccessfully for them. His team quarreled a lot. Once, one of the players even had an argument with the referee and he was shown a red card. There was one game when they lost with a score 8-0. Honestly, they didn't have any chances. It's no wonder they were eliminated almost at the beginning. Anyway, my brother was really nervous and even wanted to refuse to play because he didn't want to let his team down. Eventually, the coach persuaded him. My brother felt he was in good form and was ready to compete. It turned out to be a wise decision after all. My brother scored three goals in the second half. They defeated their opponents, which means their team got into the semi-final. This season they have been particularly unstoppable. They haven't lost any games yet. They even haven't drawn a single match. They have all chances to win the whole thing or to be the runner-up at the very least. I think there were two things that helped them greatly improve their performance. First, at the beginning of the year, the university invested a lot of money into new sport facilities. They've got now a brand new pitch with artificial grass and all other things that are important. I'm neither an expert nor a huge football fan, so excuse me if I don't know much about the subject. Apart from that, their coach focused on promoting their team spirit, because football, as well as any other sport, is not only about your skills, but also about your ability to cooperate with others. The game was amazing, and I think all of the spectators enjoyed it. You know, that's why I go to the stadium. Not for the game itself, but for the special atmosphere. It sounds strange, but although I love doing sports, I hardly ever watch them on TV. Although I do know some British athletes, especially those who have become famous worldwide. For example, did you know that an English long-distance runner is currently holding a world record for marathons? Instead of sitting in a stuffy room and watching TV, I'd rather go out and do something active. By the way, next winter I'm going to go skiing in the Alps. I heard the slopes are quite difficult there, but I think if I find a good ski instructor for the first week, he or she will teach me how to cope with them. What about you? What is your favorite sport and why? Have you ever participated in a competition? Share your answers with us in the chat.